and welcome back to Crochet for Cats. So this is a bit of a different video. This is the 10 yarn questions tag that I got tagged in. And I got tagged by Froggy Wayne to Mitten. Um, yeah. So the first question is what is your favourite colour of yarn? That's kind of a hard question. If you look up here you may notice I really like a lot of colours, bright ones, rainbow ones, pinks, purples. I'm going to say my favourite colour though is probably pink or purple. Um, what is your favourite yarn? Uh, this is a tricky question. Um, the most common yarn weight I use is DK because it's the most readily available weight but I think my favourite weight is actually iron because it's better for making something warm to wear, making a thicker fabric, things like that. What is your favourite style of yarn? Now this is a question I'm not really sure about. Um, like I, I've heard of different styles of yarn, I've heard of woven and chain plied and things, but mostly I just have the normal spun type of yarn, so I guess that would be my favourite. I'd have to try other types to really know the answer to that one. What is my favourite fibre of yarn? This would have to be... Mm, acrylic probably. Acrylic is good for a lot of things. You can use it for blankets, clothes, toys. It's really easy to wash. It doesn't need any like super special care instructions. So if you're making it for someone with a kid or somebody you know who's going to be washing it regularly acrylic is good for that. I I do like other fibres but that's going to be my favourite one. Um, what is your favourite brand that you can get easily within your country? That would have to be Stylecraft. It's really easy to get a hold of. I can get online, I can get in some stores. It comes in lots of colours and it's pretty soft as well. Um, what is your favourite brand that isn't easy to get within your country? Um, that was a harder question. I haven't tried many yarns from outside of what I can get easily. So, but With knowing that, I would say it would have to be Lily Sugar and Cream. I like that cotton, it's good for dish toss, I've made a frisbee with it, I've made placemats, it's it's soft, a bit durable and it comes in really pretty colours. Um, favourite yarn store online and favourite brick and mortar. So my favourite online store would have to be Lincoln Woolpack. I really love their service, I love the variety they have and the layout of the website is really nice, it's simple and easy to navigate. Now, brick and mortar, uh, that, that's a hard one. I'm going to probably say Aldi, which is technically not a yarn store, but they do have yarn in pretty frequently and I really like it. If you look up here actually, this pink, blue and purple yarn that's there, there and there, that's from Aldi along with that one and that one. So yeah, I really like Aldi's. Do you keep scrap yarn? If so, what do you do with it? So scrap yarn, I, I keep all my scraps and um, depending on the size depends on what it gets used for. So if it's kind of a biggish ball, like 
This size of a ball can be considered scraps, depending on the size of the ball. This is 50 grams. So if I had an 100 gram ball or a 200 gram ball or something, this could be considered scraps. And it's good for maybe a small amigurumi or striping a hat or something. If you've got really small scraps that really aren't much, then those are really good for just tying together and making something that isn't necessarily going to be really pretty, but it's going to be useful. Like the peg bag I recently made and I have designed. I'm working on writing the pattern for it, but I just use lots of scraps and I just tie them together and crocheted with it. So that's what I do with them. Um, what is your favourite thing to crochet or knit? Well, I don't knit, so it would have to be crochet. Um, hmm. Probably either shawls or squares. They are two things I really like and I don't know which one to pick. I I'll go with shawls. I do really like making shawls. If you could crochet or knit one last thing for the rest of your life, what would it be and what yarn would you use? So I think I would make a blanket because they take a long time and they take a decent amount of yarn. So that would probably be a good one to make. Um, and what yarn would I use? Hmm. Maybe some... DK. What cut? What kind of brand? Maybe some Aldi's type yarn would be nice. They do have a fairly good variety. Um, or maybe a Stylecraft. One of those two. They're both nice for making blankets. I have made blankets out of both, so that's how I know. So that was all of the questions, and um. All of you that watch and don't have a channel to, um, you know, post on, you can comment down below your answers to the 10 questions and I will be putting the 10 questions in the description so you can read them there. So I'm also going to tag some people like everybody else. So the ones I'm going to tag are Jan are hers. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but it will be linked by them below. We've got Christine Gearing, and lastly, I'm going to tag Kim at Affordably Crafty. So I hope they will join in and do the tag. So, um, remember, comment, like, subscribe, and ring the bell and everything down below.